I've made my way down to the Evian Suite and delighted to be joined by uh, Jonathan Ross and Anton Deck. Hi. 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 I'm good. Hi. 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 <laughs> Jonathan, now you're an accomplished tennis player, aren't you? I'm not really, no. I'm a low level club player, but I love playing tennis. I play it all the time. I'm working on my forehand at the moment. It's going terribly. Don't even ask about it. Even Jimmy Carr's beating me. It's a oh, shame. 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 It's a shock. And everybody you... beats Jimmy Carr. They do, yeah. yeah. Have you beaten Jimmy Carr? I've never beaten Jimmy Carr. Yeah, okay. Not at tennis, anyway. <laughs> well, well, <laughs> only with my fists. <laughs> You've obviously got the moral high ground on him, like we all do. However, I suspect, I suspect even you could beat him, even though you don't play tennis. But I am at the moment losing to him, which is a shame. Oh, that is a real shame. Keep working on that game. Yeah. Um, let's talk about the tennis today. Andy Murray is on uh, centre court right now, which I know you're dashing off to yes. see. Uh, he's up against uh, Grigor Dimitrov. Now, tell me, are you massive Andy Murray supporters? Yeah, and this is the first time we've been to Wimbledon. Never been before, so we're very excited. Wimbledon virgins, we are. So, and what do you make of it so far? I'm loving it. I'm loving it. We've had a nice lunch, glass of champagne. This is how so everybody this does is it. Does everybody get hospital? It's yeah. sweet and a glass of champagne. Everybody so does. Every spectator gets this. Yeah. What, this is what a great this is day out, folks. Of football and golf. <laughs> you know, you're thinking, why haven't I come before? Yeah. It's like it's... So, Jonathan, you've invited them as your guests. Yes, sort of. Are you slightly worried about your company? No, not at all. They're, I know they'll behave. Of course, they'll behave themselves. They're worried about being seen with me, is the truth of the matter. <laughs> but really, no, is that gonna, true? We bumped into Judy Murray on the way in oh, early on. Really? And A, she was, you know, obviously, we're all here for Andy. But at the same time, I know that she finds Dimitrov, as most people do, very, very attractive. Well, you remind me of him, actually. Thank you, thank you. So, here's the thing. Who's she going to be cheering for? I think we need to watch those eyes, because Andy will win a point and she'll be cheering on the outside, but on the inside, dying a little bit, I think. <laughs> I've spoken to Judy quite a few times this week. Unfortunately, Jamie's been knocked out of the doubles in the mix, but uh, she's, uh, you know, raring for Andy to be successful. And Andy Murray, in terms of his personality, a day, do you, do you find that him, he was quite endearing last year when he, uh, he came to tears on the court? Oh, absolutely. What a great moment that was. You know, you could see how much it meant to him uh, and what a big, big deal it was. And, and you know, I, I think he kind of understands that the, the country's behind him and he gets all of that. And it's, it, you know, it weighs on his shoulders. To, so to have won last year was a, was a great moment. And, and the, it was the Olympics, really, that kind of made him realise yeah. that Look, we actually love you. You know, we don't all think you're a Dallas Scott. You know, we're behind you, and I think he, I think he kind of felt that energy from the crowd. And last year was fantastic. And it almost means a bit more, doesn't it? When he when he broke down and stuff, you think, oh, he really means that because he wouldn't do he's that. He's human. <laughs> we like he's it. He's not a machine. Yeah, exactly. Are you men that cry? Oh, I cry a lot. I cry all the time. Yeah. Why? Just je just <laughs> generally. I mean, just. Just look just... at him. What do you think? <laughs> Why do you think? But I love the fact that Andy afterwards, even when he, even when he has a, a classic, magnificent winner come out and go, it was a very difficult game. <laughs> there's, no easy, there's no easy games at this level. It's something like that. It's, yeah. I, I'll be back. I mean, that's what he says. Wow. Chats, it's been highly entertaining. I just want to talk about the, the match afterwards, which is uh, Nick Kyrgios. Uh, he's on court against Milos Raonic. He's this young uh, Australian wild card. He's all over the press in Australia and here. Uh, did you see Nick beat Rafa yesterday? I saw. I was a little... I mean, I wanted Rafa to get through, to be honest with you. But it's always exciting when you see new talent. What a player. Incredible pace on the ball. Incredible kind of inventive shot making. And also seemed fearless. Yeah. So I don't know whether it would dawn him. I'm not sure I agree with that haircut for the London t Tennis... <laughs> the Lawn Tennis Association. I'll be honest with you. Z, I don't know whether that's OK. Is that OK? And the, and the jewellery around yeah. the neck the whole time? I mean, it was a bit M&M for my taste. Well, he's refreshing, let's put it that way. Let's be polite and say he's refreshing. <laughs> okay. and, then, and then let's beat it out of him. <laughs> he is a wild card. Who knows? He could go on and uh, achieve what Goran Ivanisevic achieved in 2001, winning. How was your tennis, by the way, Dad? Uh, it's not great. I haven't played for a long time. I'm concentrating on my golf. Okay. My golf's bad enough. Uh, right. That takes a lot of my time and effort. Yeah. So uh, my tennis isn't very good at all. We used to play a lot, didn't we, tennis? Well, yeah, the only person I've ever played at tennis is you. And yeah. how's, your, how's your tennis? All right, yeah, pretty good. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's, um, well, it used to be 50-50, didn't it? Yeah, it did. We, we used oh, to no, have pretty not, good games. That's not genuine scoring in tennis, <laughs> but that's how we played it. 50-50. <laughs> yeah. A point <laughs> each, all square, <laughs> oh. we're happy. Great stuff. And finally, Jonathan, just really quickly, you've been here before, obviously. Yes. What is it like walking out onto centre court in the atmosphere? Because you will have to been in some of the watch. best stadiums in the world. <laughs> <laughs> to, to play and to watch. Well, to play, unfortunately, I don't know yet, but I put myself down as a wild card for next year, so who knows? I'll, I'll, have, like, a, I'll have a word for you. I'll have like think that's a, a Cinderella story <laughs> waiting to happen. The viewers uh, on live at Wimbledon this want is, to do as a wild card. This is the best tennis tournament in the world. It's the, the most beautiful place to be. It's wonderful grounds, incredible. Grass court is the match to watch always, and the atmosphere when you go out there is extraordinary, especially when there's someone that we're all rooting for. So we're, we're very lucky to be here. Fabulous. Let's do it. Can you cheer for Andy Murray straight down the lens? A big Come on, cheer. Andy. Come on, Andy. Come on, you can Love do it. it.
Thanks, chaps. Have a wonderful day. Thank you. Good stuff. Thank Back you. to you. Go on, Andy. On. There's no easy games. <laughs> Terminator. It's like he's here. It's like he's wow. here. You are him. Hello, Mum. Sorry, I didn't play too well. I'm going to win again. You're too excited. <laughs> yes, too excited. Go, go, go quick. Oh, You've got to go. Thank you. Bye.